What is up guys, Mr. Who's Boss here, and in this video we're going to be talking about 4 different technologies that I think are going to change the world. So to begin with we've got artificial intelligence and this is something that I find amazing. So what is artificial intelligence? Basically it is the ability to actually program a robot or a machine to actually have a consciousness in the same way that humans do. A robot that can learn from its mistakes and develop in the same way that we do. Imagine calling up customer service and instead of speaking to some dumb switchboard, you actually talk to what feels like a real person who can accurately deal with your problems and understand the real situation. Or a robot which could stand in an operation room and observe heart surgery and then eventually after a lot of experience could then repeat it. In a really interesting experiment that scientists conducted, they managed to actually fully replicate 100% the brain of a worm and insert it into a robot. So this robot you see here is actually controlled by the artificial intelligence of a worm and acts in exactly the same way a worm would in that robot's body. It's amazing when you think about it. Next up is drones. And yeah, we have drones right now. Everybody loves drones, except the US government. But the point is that drones are getting more and more advanced every day and I got a feeling they're going to become a big part of our life. For example, to begin with, even companies like Amazon are starting to adopt them. They were testing drones to be used for delivery of packages. Imagine instead of next day shipping there's an option for two hour delivery, where a drone simply picks up the package from the warehouse and drops it outside your door. We're going to have drones that can follow you and shoot automatically stabilized full HD or 4K slow motion video. I mean imagine the possibilities, you could be climbing the Himalaya mountains or skiing down the French Alps and this robot is here with you all the time recording everything you see. You wouldn't even have to worry about carrying a GoPro. It could do loops round you, fly up, fly down, take still pictures. Now what is one problem you really have with your smartphone? We've got amazing displays, extremely fast performance and cameras that rival digital offerings. But battery life has always been an issue. Graphene is here to save that. It is an extremely, extremely dense store of energy and can actually offer up to 10 times the battery of a traditional lithium ion one that we're using now. It can charge much faster, it weighs less, it takes up much less space and it's even flexible. Once this is implemented, we could expect to see smartphones that are just 3mm thick with batteries lasting up to 10 days of medium to heavy usage. Just imagine. Now last and absolutely not least, we have virtual reality. And yet again, like a lot of these technologies, this has been on the horizon for a while now. Even mainstream companies like Sony, like Oculus, like Steam are all demoing their own VR technologies. But this is just the beginning of a huge revolution. Virtual reality is going to become a big part of our lives. Whilst virtual reality is great now, it's very, very far from reaching its potential. You know, even now we can actually stick a virtual reality headset on our head and look around inside these worlds that have been created out of nothing. That's great. But in the future, it's about to get a hell of a lot better. Imagine a scenario where you're fully immersed in the experience, where you can sit down inside vehicles, where you can run around on the battlefield, where you can headshot snipers and be shot yourself and feel the physical impact. Guys, that is the future of gaming, and it's coming to a living room near you very soon. Okay guys, that's it from me. Thanks once again for watching. I'm Mr. Who's the Boss, and this is Insanely, Insanely Cool Tech.